Well, today we had the uh, Harley Davidson 110th anniversary parade. Thousands of bikes going out on parade. So I mean, it was cool to be part of that. You know, I've never, I've never been a part of a parade. To be, you know, on a Harley going down the street, all the, everybody's just waving at you and stuff was, uh, was pretty cool. Just to be part of it. I mean, I'm, I'm honored. You know, uh, I never thought I, I would be part of it. So I'm glad to be here. The bikes that you see today are what we know to be the largest collection of unrestored Harleys in the world. The beginning when, when Harley started, up until now, we kind of picked a model or two from, from the lineup and then uh, just uh, saved them here. We do have one of every model a year. We don't have one of every model of every year because I once crunched the numbers out of curiosity and that'd be like 7,700 bikes. It's really cool to look at the history of them, you know, to come in here, see where they all started. Um, See how the, how the bikes now still have that little, you know, old school flair. That's the oldest Harley Davidson motorcycle that we know to exist. It's a 1903 04 vintage engine. The very first Harley that would have been sold would look exactly like this. I kind of heard, you know, stories of, uh, of the first bike, you know, being built. Also, just uh, the space that the first owners, you know, had, the little shed that they had. That's what started the image of Harley riders as badasses. What happened is that photo was published in Life magazine, and then they based the movie The Wild One on it. After The Wild One, everybody starts thinking of bikers as, like, troublemakers. Just uh, excited to be here and uh, just, just taking it all in, so... And just a big thanks to Harley to, for, for letting me uh, come in here and uh, see all their bikes. Pettis, fourth round head kick. He Milwaukee boy. I'm a Milwaukee boy. We grew up in the same area, drank the same water, so he's, he's got this. I'm a Milwaukee boy, but I think Benson will retain the belt by decision. Pettis, all day. Benson's been on the roll. Is stopping everyone. He's unstoppable. Pettis is going to win totally. Knockout. Anderson. Knockout. Anderson. Pettison has a toothpick in his mouth. Who are, who's he? <laughs> We're not even talking to that guy anymore. Undefeated in the UFC. Time to go to work, baby. Time to go to work. Time to go to work. Avoid the takedowns at all costs, make him, make him harder to get a takedown. Uh, I think the one he got me down when I tried a carlo kick and he kind of just got on top of me. But uh, the game plan went good, I'm feeling good, and uh, I'm happy I got to start. You know what? It's, it's been a long road, man. From from a childhood to, to losing my dad to uh, you know getting the WC title, losing to Clay Guida. You lose once and everybody says you suck. I, I pulled through, man. I just pulled through. I knew I'm the best in the world and I, I want to prove it to everybody that I'm the best in the world. Stay here, Milwaukee. Don't know it. 